All right, so I think we're going to spend most of the time this meeting on the landlord registration. Um, I do want to just the promoting the current programs. We we really got to get something out there because I don't. Jet, do we have anything? No. Okay. So I know. Um, just try to get something. We got to get something out there to promote it, whether it's on the West City website. Um, can we get front page of the website? So we do have uh, on the website currently, we do have the, uh, through chip page on community development, we do have the owner outside rehab program and the residential facade program. Um, those, all those documents are still on there. Um, but uh, I mean, we could do a we could do a social media push if you'd like through the city's website or city's Facebook page. And, and, you know, you guys have a Facebook page. We right? have so one. Jennifer Jennifer, I think, is O'Connor's yeah. kind of yeah. manning that up. So we can ask her to post it on yeah. there as well. Or maybe share off of your page. Just kind of a yeah, and that'd be perfectly fine. Um, mm -hmm. Obviously, it, it, you know, it's been a while since you guys have gotten any applications for either of those programs. Um, and yet, I think there's still definitely a need out there as I drive around. Uh, mm -hmm. So, yes, um, so. I'm going to say that gently and kindly. Uh, so, with that being said, yeah, I think we can definitely push that as an option out there. Okay. Uh, Correct me if I'm wrong. Does, do driveways count? I don't for the for the residential facade. Mm -hmm. Yes. They yes. do. I was going to say, I know the sidewalk it. does. I just didn't know if the driveway does. I'm 99% sure. And ultimately, that, I mean, whether it says that in the program or not, that's ultimately up to you guys to decide anyway. Okay, so that'd be okay, and that could be a huge. I, I'm just, I'm thinking of Westgate people. I, I was talking to oh, yeah. lady, uh, Kim Mitchell. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> She's got a daycare, and she was like, well, we think about doing the rest of it, yep. but she is able to. Shit, that's a business, so mm -hmm. she can, you know, some of the some of it's right off, and then she can get a those too. If I can interject, I had a, a person reach out. Are we? I don't know how this relates. Uh, a business that's not downtown, that's in a residential area. Are we open to possibility of doing a side grant of that? I mean, is it strictly a business or is it out of their house? Strictly a business. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we are considered a housing authority, so they can have to be strict with that. But I just want to <clears throat> yeah, if it were out of like a, like a, yeah, like a hair salon out of a house, a hair yeah. salon out of the house that maybe, yeah. maybe, maybe you live there, maybe it's you know, deemed both, I guess. Can it be? It can be deemed residential and commercial, or no? Uh, from a taxing perspective, that would be. There's a zoning. It, it's a zoning thing more than a taxing yeah. perspective, I think. So I'm our house is zoned in. residential one, but we have a special exception to allow to do that. Yes, that's what I'm saying. Okay. Hi, Jennifer. So essentially, what we're saying is.